next meeting in here? Yes. I'm an old friend. I never forget you. Bye. This is very nostalgic. <laughs> I'm going to awkwardly start vlogging in the middle of all these people. I am back at TEDx Manchester High School. This is the actual site where I gave my TEDx talk three years ago, how to magically connect with anyone. I am vlogging, yes. I run, I run, you wanna be in my vlog? Put me in the vlog. Yo, yes. what's good? What's your name? I'm Logan. Logan, what are you doing here? I'm DJing. You're, are you DJing That's for what TEDx? I do. Heck yeah, I am. That's awesome, Logan. That's what, I uh, do. what year are you in? I'm, uh, I'm a sophomore. Cool. What do you want to do? Are you thinking about going to school or college? Or yeah, uh, I want to go to Penn State. I want to go do Air Force ROTC and try to be a fighter pilot. Dude, first make, of all, make tons of music on the way. That, first of all, okay, three things on that. One, a good friend of mine is in the army as a musician stationed in Germany, so that's totally possible. That's awesome. Two, I've done three tours for the troops with Navy Entertainment really? all over the world, so we could talk about that. And third, I've worked for Penn State many, many times, and they're awesome. <laughs> so that was like three awesome things in there one, one meeting. So it. introduce yourself. Hello, my name is Alyssa. Alyssa, hey, and you said you were... <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> you, said, you said earlier you were an itty-bitty sophomore. Yes, I'm an itty-bitty sophomore. <laughs> but you were speaking at this conference. Yeah, I'm one of the student speakers. That is amazing. For, for my uh, audience out there, being a student speaker, see most TEDx conferences are like professionals, uh, but because this is held at a high school, it is also open to students, and it is very competitive and very impressive to get selected. It is highly competitive. There's only two student spots. So what are you speaking on tomorrow? Oh, I'm speaking on my childhood and boundaries in my childhood. Yeah, oh right, that's a, the, the theme of this conference is boundaries. It's, it's somewhere, it's on something here. Uh, any, it's kind of a two second, like a sneak preview, like what about boundaries? Or we'll just find out tomorrow. I think you will just find out tomorrow. Find out. So when the whole conference is over, I'll get your feedback then on how you feel like you did? Awesome. Boom. <laughs> so yeah, this is actually the site of the conference that I spoke at a few years ago. They've changed a bunch since then. Look at how beautiful sign. Those of you who've seen my talk, you remember the infamous TEDx cups. That was the year that the whole background here was not like this. It was all uh, so red solo cups, which affectionately on Reddit ended up with a thread, TEDx cups. Maybe that was what helped my uh, talk get noticed. Everybody was like, who is this fedora wearing goofball in a suit with all these red solo cups behind him? <laughs> Here, this is the dress rehearsal. Their uh, conference is tomorrow morning. I'm kind of just answering some questions, last minute FAQs for the speakers, kind of wondering about giving the uh, the talk and what it's going to feel like. And uh, like somebody asked me, what do you do if you forget something? And those kind of questions. So I'll be at the conference tomorrow morning and uh, we'll touch base. It's the morning of the TEDx conference. It is very early. I have an hour drive to get out back to Manchester High to support all the speakers for their incredibly important day. We'll pick up in a minute. When the lights are out and you stumble in the dark You kept pushing on but then you went too far When your ship has sailed and all your dreams are lost Everything is wrong I feel like this has been a recurring theme lately, but I've been driving for a long time. There has been just nothing but traffic. I'm at another red light, another stop, complete standstill. I'm gonna be getting there later than I wanted to be. I was hoping to be there half an hour before the conference started. I'm probably only gonna make it there 20 minutes before the conference starts now. I'll hopefully get some time to interview Parag Joshi, who is the, uh, the teacher from Manchester High who runs the conference, and he was the one who, who you know, invited me to give my TEDx talk that uh, changed my life and career. So. You gotta leave now, 
Head to park way down around the corner like half a mile down the road. It's only 40 degrees, even though it's almost May. It's the only thing I know how to talk about anymore. Why is it still so cold? We'll start left now. Good morning, good morning, good morning. How are you doing? TEDx is an initiative of the TED Conference, a nonprofit devoted to ideas worth spreading. We grant free licenses to allow TED like events to spread globally. This event today is based on the TED Conference format and ideals, but is independently organized by your local community. So please make sure I've been very fortunate in my life to have many wonderful outdoor adventures. And when I talk about them, usually I focus on the, the wonder, the inspiration of it all. But today I'd like to take a different tack. I'd like to focus on the difficulty. I was also very depressed during this time, and Parker really knew that. I was six the first time I realized my parents were dysfunctional. We would never get back together. Hey, come here. You did a great job. Thank you really, so much. really great. How do you how do you feel? Recap. Oh, recap. I feel great. <laughs> you feel great, yeah? yeah I, I did I feel like I did a lot better today than I did at the practice last night. Awesome. I felt more confident. Boom, you nailed it. Really, really proud of you. <laughs> Enjoy it. <laughs> I need to get this guy before you leave. Thank you for your guidance in the beginning. It, 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 was, it was amazing. It, it was all about mountain climbing and risks and Everest. The story is insane. When I talk about that stuff, I'm talking about it metaphorically. You literally climbed Mount Everest. <laughs> Which is, like when we talk about dying on stage, that's not what we mean. <laughs> literally minutes after the talks have ended, it's all gone. That's it. That I'm always having to make so do you want to introduce yourself uh, and, and kind of give us the <laughs> give us the uh, official who are you? <laughs> okay. Hi, I'm Prav Joshi and uh, I produce these TEDx conferences along with a lot of people. Yeah. And it's fun, exhilarating, exhausting, and uh, every time I say this, I'll never do this again, and then I can't wait till next year. <laughs> so, are you excited for next year now? We'll oh see. yeah, we'll see. You know, we we won't hold you to that. <laughs> but basically, within the context of all of my viewers, uh, who all know me, mostly either know me from my TEDx talk. This is the guy who found me. I mean, we got connected through mutual friends. That's it was, right. We did it. It was. Was that your first year running it? Yes. It was. It was your first year. So we kind of got bound in life by that experience. <laughs> That's right. Uh, kind of worked out well. So That's right. I owe this guy a lot. I owe so. this guy a lot. <laughs> <laughs> That's it, it is all over. This year's TEDx conference was a smashing success. Seriously, you guys, I, I'm gonna have to plug when, uh, let, let you know when all of those talks go up on YouTube because so many of them, amazing. So yeah, as is always the case, I have a lot to do. I've got two phone calls. I originally thought I was gonna be out of here at like one, it's 2.30. Uh, I have a three o'clock call. Good, my car's still here. Uh, I have a 3 o'clock call and a 5.30 call. I'm also rehearsing for a presentation I need to give tomorrow morning at 7 a.m. over an hour from home. So I'm going to be dead tomorrow. <laughs> I would have to be up at like 4.45 or 5 o'clock in the morning to be out of the house in time to get there and give it. I need to finish rehearsing for that tonight. So I am going to sign off even though it's only the mid-afternoon. It was an awesome time hanging out at, uh, at the, the, the TEDx conference that changed my life. Uh, what Parag is doing for everybody there is just, it's incredible. To do it at a high school, unbelievable.
So that's it for me. Always remember that our world is a shared experience. Have a good night. Stretch the legs. So far there's been, I don't know, four or five. Who goes that? Yeah, put me in the vlog. Yeah. <laughs> what's, what's your name? Felix. Felix? I, I can't. I, that's, that was weird. I don't know what just happened. That was very uncomfortable. That's going to be the blooper reel at the end.